and I want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see is disturbing. Instead of tending to this crying five-month-old girl, the nanny just tries to shut her up. Some disturbing pictures tonight. A baby girl shaken and tossed around by her nanny. It's every parent's nightmare. Child minders hired to look after children abusing their trust. For one Moscow company, the answer is nanny cam. Nanny cams are covert surveillance cameras that can be disguised as vases, teddy bears, and other household objects and placed around the house to monitor the activities of nannies, maids, and other domestic employees. Oftentimes, the employees do not know they are being watched. Even though we did everything we possibly could, people need to maintain their suspicion because, you know, a stranger with a resume and a good reference is still a stranger in your house. While nanny cams can help put a stop to incidents like these, some feel that they undermine the relationship between domestic employees and the families they work for. I'd work the same with or without a camera, but saying that, when I know I'm being watched, it makes me feel tense and uncomfortable. Many nannies feel they are an invasion of privacy. Although it is legal for families to use nanny cams in their homes, is it an invasion of privacy? Is it ever ethical to monitor people's private activities or correspondence? What do you think? <laughs>